everybody. Today I'm going to read you Grover Goes to School. Uh, because I think this is a good book to read to you guys because we're not in school. So I chose this out just to read to you. I'm so happy to read to you today. And so, Grover Goes to School by Dan Elliott. Illustrated by Norman Chartier. Look at all those guys. Thanks. Grover Goes to School by Dan Elliott, illustrated by Norman Chartier. Today was the big day. It was the first day of school for Grover. And Grover was ready before the sun came up. His mother gave him a brand new pencil box, a new box of big crayons, a lunchbox full of jelly sandwiches, and a big hug and kiss goodbye. I'll be the only one from Sesame Street, said Grover. What if nobody likes me? His mother smiled. Just be yourself, she said. You are lo very lovable. But Grover was not so sure. He walked slowly to school. I'll try hard to make everyone like me. At the school, teacher gave all the children a big hello. My name is Mr. Lester, he said. And what is your names? One by one, they said their names. Truman, Jill, Molly, Bill. Oh, said Grover, said to, said Grover to himself. There are so many children. Finally, it was Grover's turn, and he st st stood up and said shyly, I am Grover. I want to be friends with everybody. After they all said their name, Mr. Lester said, let them draw pictures. He passed out paper and boxes of old crayons. I can use my own cray new crayons, said Grover. Truman looked up Grover's crayons. Hey, Grover, if you give me your crayons, I'll give you my chalk. Grover looked at the toy truck. It was missing three wheels. And Grover loved his new crayons. Oh, dear, Grover said to himself. If I say no, Truman will not like me. So he gave his crayons to Truman and tried to play with the truck. Bumpity bump bump. But the truck, it was not that much more. Soon, Mr. Lester said, Time for milk and cookies. But before you eat, you must clean up. Then Grover had an idea. You can eat right now, he said to the children near to him. I, right, Grover, the clean upper, will put everything away. The children ran to the cookies. Thanks, Grover, they shouted. Oops. Grover cleaned up the crayons, lumps of green clay, and the blocks on the floor. Now I'll get my cookie, said Grover happily. But all the cookies were gone. Oh no, we forgot to save a cookie for Grover, the children said. It's okay, I do not mind, Gro said Grover sadly. Soon it was time to play outside. I'll ask my new friends to play hopscotch with me. But they were already jumping rope. You can turn the rope for us, said Jill. Grover did not want to turn the rope, but he said, okay. Finally, it was time for lunch. Grover opened his lunchbox. Truman watched him. If you give me a jelly sandwich, I'll give you my, my bologna. Grover did not like bologna, but he said, okay. Suddenly, tears became rolling down Grover's furry face. Why are you crying, Grover? Said, asked Millie. Because I do not like this broken truck. I miss my crayons. I did not get a cookie. I do not like jump rope. And I hate baloney. Grover cried and cried. I will cheer you up, Molly, said Molly. Do you want to play marbles? Grover stopped crying. Well, I like Jack's better, he said. I do not know how to play jacks, so Molly Grover started to cry again. But maybe you can teach me jacks, so Molly. 
Now Grover really stopped crying. Oh yes, I am so happy to teach you. He and he really meant it. Grove Molly got up to three Z's and then it was time to put it away to Jackson and learn to write. Grover opened his new pencil box. What a neat pencil box, said Bill. Wanna trade? Grover looked at Bill's pencil box then as his own. He thought for a minute, then Grover shook his head. No, he said, I like mine better. Okay, said Bill, and he was not mad. Grover was so happy, he smiled at Bill's. Bill, do you like Jack's, asked Grover. My favorite game, Bill said, mine too, said Grover. After school, Grover, Bill, and Molly played Jack. And then Grover ran home. I have two new friends, he told his mother. Two new friends in one day, she said. That's a lot. It sure is, said Grover. The end. I had fun reading to you guys. Thank you for watching.